Hello. Hello. <laughs> uh, thanks for joining me here. I'm sorry, I'm just, this is looking very unprofessional. I'm finding a prick here on my wallet. Okay. Uh, I'm glad you could all be here. I don't know how many people are here. I can't really see. Uh, I would normally use my phone to see the comments and stuff, but as it's, uh, I'm doing, I've kind of set it in my mind that I'm going to be doing original stuff only tonight. Uh, I'm basically re relying on the words in the <laughs> on my phone here uh, because nobody's perfect and uh, I'm terrible at remembering words at the best of the time. So especially when it's my own, it's kind of bad when you get the words wrong and you're the only one that knows it. So I've decided to do completely original stuff because I'm trying to push it as much as possible. I've I've spent a long, long time writing and I've not really uh, kind of pushed myself as much as I've wanted to. So now's the time, you know, I'm getting getting fed up now and I'm wanting to really, really show people the songs that I've really worked on and put, poured my heart into and I really want to, hopefully, it resonates with other people. If it makes people hear and feel certain things, then by all means, my job is then done. Um, I'm going to do... I've got, got a set um, plan of what songs I'm going to be doing. I'm just literally going to be looking through them and picking the songs that I feel like I, I want to do. Hopefully you guys like it. I don't know who's on, like I say, but feel free to comment anyway because I'm I'll just get people to shout them out to me so I know. And I'll reply to as many people as I can. Uh, and share it. Please share it as much as possible because it's, uh, like I say, it's a, it's a hard, hard world out there for any musicians and songwriters, as a lot of you all know. So as much as much publicity as possible, just now, you know, try and spread some good in this bad, bad world at the moment. It's all it's all for good, 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 good causes for us. Another big thank you as well I've got to put before I start is uh, the use of this guitar and the use of the studio. My guitar has decided to uh, contract COVID in some way because it's decided to stop working. Um, there's wiring or something's gone. I went and bought batteries and everything, thinking it was me being a tech wizard, thinking I would fix it, but nah, it's nothing. So I need to get that looked at. So the, the use of this magical guitar by my dad, Graham Brown, and the use of this magical studio as well. So I need to big thank you to him and loads and loads of thank yous in the comments to him as well. Because without that, I wouldn't be able to do this just now. Okay. This first song is called Bad Joke and I wrote it about four years ago and it's sat in my cupboard basically without me looking at it ever. And I decided to pick up the guitar and have a look at it again last night and the night before. And I, I've just kind of re-fell in love with it again. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. It's a bit of fun. This is Bad Joke. But I know the reason why If you see those headlights All shining bright Remember all the fun you had with him last night Stop me if you've heard this one before A man walks into a bar and he asks for more Says, son, have you been working here long? He says, no, sir, I'm only five feet tall. I want bad joke, I want your bad joke. I want bad joke, I'm your bad joke. Did you drink last night? Was it more than enough? Enough to give you a nasty fright? Tell me, have you been here once before? Sweet shoes on the dancing floor. Stop me if you've heard this one before. in a bar and he asks for more. He says, 
says, son, have you been working here long? He says, no, sir, I'm only five feet tall. I'm one bad joke on your bad joke. I'm one bad joke I'm your bad joke. One bad joke on your bad joke. One bad joke on your bad joke. I've been roaming through this life, looking for what I can be. Can you throw me a lifeline? Or cast me away to the sea Taste of your lips I divine Get me away from here I hear you touch me one last time oh, Can you touch me one last time oh, Can you touch me one last time Touch me one last time. Oh, 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 oh. One bad joke. Oh, I'm your bad joke. I'm one bad joke. Oh, I'm your bad joke. Oh, I'm one bad joke. Oh, I'm one bad joke. One bad joke, I'm your bad joke. One bad joke. Thank you. Thank you very much. If you couldn't guess that that song was called Bad Joke. But yeah, that's a story about being treated horribly and never really understanding why. You know, never knowing why someone could, you seem to think that they love could treat you in such a way that, you know, they, they, they never really did. But moving on. Do you like my Starbucks cup? It's not got a vanilla latte or macchiato in it. It's plain old H2O. Uh, this is a this is a funny story to this song. I woke up in, s in a hot sweat, but two or three nights ago, and it was a well, that's kind of a red flag right away in this current condition. But uh, I woke up having the most detailed and vivid dream, and the dream was so strange and so storytelling that it ended up kind of forcing me to write a song, kind of off the basis of it. And it took me easily about five or ten minutes just because I was literally just. It was almost like I was copying someone because it was just, it came to me by accident and I just basically started writing it down. Um, I fell in love with it right away. It's about life being a bit more difficult than you'd care to, care to admit. Going through things and, yeah. Uh, it's about things being a bit more difficult than I'd care to admit and having, having problems and still trying to deal with them, still trying to get through life and... At the end of the day, coming back to the one you you know you're going to spend the rest of your life with. I'm going to quickly tune this guitar because it doesn't doesn't like me that much. Ah, oh. oh, decent. Okay. That usually is a grueling process. It takes me about five minutes. This is called I'll Make It Easy. All the while I'll think about you Every lie cuts deeper than truth And every single tear you shed Leaves you haunted by the 
mirrors around your bed Every now and then I feel my heart beat again It's so easy to hide And when we meet again With a heavy drink and it's so hard to try I make it easy I take it easy I'll show you places you've never seen before I make it easy I take it easy and tonight I know we'll dance forever I'm not doing any favors for myself I'm not doing very well And when I see a fight break out against the little man I'll keep it down and I'll make sure I don't swell Every now and then I feel my heart beat again It's so easy to hide And when we meet again with a heavy drink and it's so hard to try I'll make it easy, I'll take it easy I'll show you places you've never seen before I'll make it easy, I'll take it easy And tonight I know we'll dance forever seen before I'll make it easy I'll take it easy and tonight I know we'll dance forever more forever more forever more and tonight I know we'll dance forever more Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> well, I very much appreciate it. This is a this is a weird experience. Not let alone obviously all the cameras and the no audience and all that. That's obviously already kind of strange. But the weird thing is like for me right now is I'm totally out of my depth playing songs I've only ever played to myself, and uh, it's song, songs that are on the list to get recorded. But obviously there's so many hours in the day that you can get stuff done. Um, but uh, it, it feels good. It feels good to. I hope you guys are enjoying it. I don't know. I don't know what you're saying, but I really do hope you guys are getting it. They're enjoying it. That's good. That's good. Glad you guys could tune in. I feel good. Oh. Oh, that's that's fantastic. That's so nice. I appreciate that a lot. Um, this next song is a song that I've been caught singing far too many times by myself. Too much than I care to mention. Um, it's a song called Alone Again. And it's about it's basically being that feeling when you're really close with someone, the one that you love, and you, you just know that you, you bounce off of each other. You, f you th think what they're thinking, and you s it's creepy to a point. Um, it's about those times when you're working in life and things get in the road and you, you, you don't get a chance to see them as often as you probably did and it just you know both of you know that it can't be helped but you can't help but feel a bit more kind of lost and missing and wishing that those times when you were alone again would would come back soon this is the this is my kind of version of that i suppose this is called alone again and this is dedicated to brooke coventry So long. 
lost without you I hate it when you're gone Now I can feel you You take that pain away Whenever I'm around you I don't know if I'll ever be alone again Mistakes, that's what they told you every single day. That's what controls you, makes you run away. Now you're on your own, making me feel we'll never be alone again. Still had to tell myself I'm wrong Everything could be worse I drink myself to death You're always on my mind How can I live When I can barely stay alive People say it's fine I have to find the bright side It happens all the time I'm sick on the inside When will this leave me alone for good? Is this the life they said we always would? Thank you. <laughs> oh, <GDV>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's always a good sign when people start singing it back to you. That's a fuss. I love it. Don't mind me in my second cup, which has got more caffeine in it than the first one. This next song I wrote while uh, the band, the Graham Brown Band, were recording. It started with a little um, guitar melody thing. It's actually quite nice, I'm playing a nylon string actually, because this will work out a bit nicer for that. Oh, well thank you very much Ian, I appreciate that, thank you. Um, this is a song I wrote, like I say, 
a good few years ago now. I've just so it gets always just the same as the others. It's sat on the back burner. Um, I wrote this with the little acoustic melody bit at the start of it, and then the song kind of just arised from that. A lot of my songs do that. Like I'll have a little kind tiny little guitar hook or a d- vocal hook that I fall in love with, and then I end up writing the song based off that entire thing. And sometimes I have no idea where the song's going, and this one is definitely definitely a version of that. Um, this is called "Not Your Tragedy," and it's quite a it's quite a soft but sad song. Hope you guys enjoy. Starting to bruise all the blacks and the blues. There's so much you don't know, so much left to lose. And when I start to cry. Why you can laugh at my tears just as long as you're here? When will you come home? I'm so tired, I'm alone. I can't wait by this bone. It's not your tragedy I am lost without you When will you come home? I'm so tired, I'm alone I can't wait by this bone all alone Can't you see? It's not your tragedy So funny now when you're never around. I don't know what to do when my heart breaks in two.
so tired I'm alone I can't wait by this phone all alone Can't you see it's not your tragedy I am lost without you When will you come Thank you. <laughs> that one takes a lot out of you. You do me. Oh. Okay. Maybe a bit of a sad kind of tearjerker, that one, but I love those ones just as much as I love the happy dance ones. It's <laughs> the smoke. It's a lot more here than it is on the camera, I'm pretty sure. So it's, it probably just looks like a decent amount, but here it's like, whoa, in your face. Um, I dedicated one of the songs there to Brooke. This one's actually about her. Uh, this one I wrote, again, not too long ago. Can't remember, can't, can't put a date on it. Uh, I've just realised again. I was supposed to clock this in my head before, but I've realised there's like loads of cameras about a lot more than I expected. Normally, there's like maybe one or two, but there's I'm getting fancy angles just now. I've got like that guy, and then we've got like that guy over there. <laughs> I just like I like the orchestration of that. That's pretty funny. And then that one again. <laughs> uh, if you haven't already, and if you're enjoying what you're uh, hearing, which uh, I'll, I'll be totally, totally mesmerised and love you forever for that. But if you're enjoying it, then uh, please, please give it a share. Share it wherever you can. Share it until someone tells you to stop sharing it and then send them a message with it in it. Um, it would be <laughs> very beneficial for me. I very much appreciate it. Um, this is called Fly Away, and this is for Brooke Coventry. Try and play the right chord first, eh? I know, you know, we've been walking around this town. You've been smoking, we've been drinking, we've been messing around. Take a cab, drive a car, we'll go anywhere that's far. Here or there, right or left, you could find me at the bar I don't feel like standing still we could talk all night until the moon will show its glow to us yeah we won't care no we won't fuss it's time we fly away we got no reason to stay
thank you. That song kind of speaks for itself. It's about freedom and getting on your feet and running and doing whatever you want to do because no one, no one can tell you what not to do and what to do. It's your choice. Hey, this one, uh, how are we doing for time? I don't even know. Got plenty of time. Good, 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 good. I've got a habit. I've, I've a big thing I have to, uh, I'll say, I call it a roadblock that I hit quite often when I'm writing songs, is I end up making the songs about 27 and a half minutes long. So I've got to cut them right down and make sure that I've only got the kind of nicest, sweetest, little softest bits in there. Um, this is one that I, I wrote, God, probably when I was about 13 or 14 and it definitely went on the pile and just never got touched and every couple of years I go back to it and I fix and tweak something take a verse out because again it's got tons in it try and fix it again and then recently I just I didn't touch a thing I went back to it and I just played it exactly the way I initially planned the original time and I fell in love with it so it's it goes to show that you can be your own worst critic and get right in your own road um, this is called follow you here you go. I'm going ten feet underground. No one will ever know. Fighting my demons right before the show. The voices in my head they make fun of me, pointing out the tragedy. But you know how to sing You know how to make my bell ring And when the voices stop
that's near The way you whispered in my ear The happy tales of things we lost The things we thought it never cost Danke soweit. Oh, dear me. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. How's, how's people? What's... Oh. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> oh, see, well, there you go. See, that's... That's not even down to me, that's down to Graham Brown, so thank him as well. <laughs> um, oh, that's too nice. You guys are too nice. You and me both. I think I did this last, this other song, um, this song here on my last live stream. But uh, I love doing it. It's a great fun one. And when there is an audience, I love to try and get them as participating as possible. So at home, try and, I don't know what camera I'm looking, but at home, sing. Sing, sing the bits that it's easy to sing, because I've made it super easy so even I could learn it. This is, uh, <laughs> I got the, <laughs> the title of this wrong the last time, which is quite funny. The song's called You and Me. Six feet underground I'm starting to drown If I swim any deeper I'll hit the ground You asked me to leave you alone You said it wasn't easy when I was home Saving grace, see your face in the palm of my hand Never lost, never found, but I'm always here to stand I'm never alone Never alone. Never alone. Never alone. It's just you and me on our own out here. It's just you and me on our own. You and me on our own out here, and I'm trying to go home. You and me on our own out here. It's just. You and me are all You and 
saw me I was lying to my health I found this gun and it showed me things It taught me how a man could win It made me see the time I lost It made me see the things it cost I'm never alone Never alone Thank you. Dear me. Deary, dear, deary, dear indeed. Thank you for tuning. I've got to remember to not hit this guitar so hard because. Um, I'm used to my, my normal guitar, my big clunky Elvis looking one that's steel string and I'd, I'd be that thing with half of its life. But uh, this obviously this is a nice delicate, soft, beautiful guitar and I can't really <laughs> can't really afford the price it costs to beat the hell out of this one. So I've got to be careful. <laughs> I've been told from the sidelines that my life depends on it, so. Okay. This is a, a song I guarantee you almost everyone can relate to. This is about being absolutely steaming drunk, having someone there worried, sick, half to death about you. But in your drunken mind, you're like, I'll be fine. I know I'm doing all right. I'll, when I stop breathing, that's when I'll call the doctor. But right now, let me stumble my way home. This is called I'll Be Fine. Wake me up, yeah, I'll be fine 
It's getting cold, but I'll be alright. I'll be fine, yeah, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Wake me up, yeah, I'll be fine. It's getting cold, but I'll be alright. I'll be fine, yeah, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Thank you. <laughs> it wasn't actually the way I was going to end that, but I decided in the heat of the moment, I quite like the simple ending sometimes. It's the most uh, unprofessional thing to do right now is I'm looking at my phone, but it's the only way I can really pick what songs I'm thinking is going to make it onto the, onto the set here. Um this is this is a weird one for me because it's such a soft song and I've never really known how to record it but I guarantee I can get away with it here because this is how I wrote it I wrote it on the acoustic I might even just keep it acoustic I don't know but it's a song I just absolutely love and uh I'll let you guys feel however you feel about it it's called grain of the wood Tell me 
Make up your mind as the evening passes us by The tale never ends till the cellos play their goodbye The sun will set as our footsteps in the sand Our lips will meet as the ocean hits our hand Thank you. Oh, yes. you know, it's, it's safe to say that I've got far too much songs backdated far too long. Oh, for time. Okay. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna see you off for one last one. This is another soft one. I probably in the book of. Uh, I don't know, songwriting and song producing and showing of songs. <laughs> it's probably not done typically that you do two kind of soft songs, one after the other, but I would say this is kind of a semi half soft, saf saft. We'll call it saft, as in the Dundee way. Saft, because it's soft and hard. So, saft. I'm sorry, I've got to detune your guitar just to drop D. I apologise. I'm. There was, there was a bit of a. <laughs> there was a bit of angst in that, it's all right. It breaks my heart as well to detune a nylon string guitar. I don't like it either. This is a... <laughs> okay, yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm going to leave you this on this song because I know things can be, what's the lack of a better term, it's, it can be a bit tough just now, especially with everything that's going on, I mean like, uh, feeling a wee bit of humanity and joy by just getting out of your bed and going to bloody Asda, it's, it's a very, very weird, strange feeling, everyone imagined when the 
apocalypse was happening, we'd have cars out in the street fighting each other, but really it's it's stuff like people taking too much toilet roll. And it's a it's a weird it's a weird, weird condition that the, the society's kind of in just now. But um I, I guarantee I, I'm confident that things will get better and I, I can only really be I can only be I can only be hopeful and it's kind of in my nature to be overly positive about these things and optimistic and it's I hope that that's kind of shown. Um this song this song's about uh, when you when you're out in the, the heaviest kind of rain and weather and storms and the, like the snow we recently had, things it can it could just add to the stuff that's going on already and it can really affect people. Uh, it sounds silly to me sometimes, but I, I, I felt it myself. The weather, especially especially heavy rain, heavy things like that, it could just it can really affect people, and especially when people are depressed and hurt and anxious and things are going on. It, it can really get to you. This is a this is a song really kind of talking about that and how things will be better, but right now it's it's hard for people to understand any situation you're in. Um, this is called Heavier Than The Rain. be a stranger in this neighborhood where everything knows and nothing should everyone has secrets but mine won't be you making promises you can't keep now you delve in too deep now you're making it hard to breathe my pain is love that you can't see your name how you been going for a gold you'll never win the broken thoughts of a lonely brain a dangerous line in an endless game Heavier in the rain. It's heavier. 
Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> I appreciate that. Um, this has been an absolute blast. I've really, really loved it. <laughs> so Shouting one more. Um, well, if you've not already done it, I would really, really appreciate everybody uh, sharing this as much as possible. Like I say, it's hard times, even harder for a musician sometimes. <laughs> um, I'm really trying to push push the stuff I'm doing. It's stuff I'm really passionate about, and I hope you guys feel the same. Uh, if it's made you enjoy any of it at all, I, I would really, really appreciate the share, uh, the comment, tell your friends, things like that. It's it's something that's uh, not done too often in the music industry, and it really should be. It's there's so much so much talent out there nowadays, and it's not uh, not even half of them get the recognition they really deserve. Um, that's why I love this live session at the studio because it's it's given a lot of artists a lot of opportunities that they wouldn't normally get um especially for people that aren't as experienced as some others it's uh, it's it breaks you into it in a really really nice and gentle way and everything is accommodated so nicely so it please if you're an artist as well and or a singer or a songwriter or anything get in contact with the planet studio page and contact them and get a set on here because it's completely free it goes out live as you do it. It doesn't get recorded live and then put out later and edited. It goes out as you do it, so it is totally you. And it's it, there's no hiding. There's really no hiding. I've made mistakes tonight, and it just shows that we're all human and real. Um, I'll do one more. Um, I'm just trying to think of what one to do. Uh, I'll do. I'll do looking for you because it's. I'll have to retune this again. Sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, okay. I wrote uh, this is the one of the kind of first songs I've ever really recorded and released, and it's out there now. So I mean, you can listen to it, but it's all its beautiful production and drums and stuff. I'll do a nice stripped back version of it. This is uh, a song that I wrote a long, long time ago. There's a music video out there for it, uh, which my good friends Laurie English and Bruce Stoke helped with. They're uh, one of my best friends all the way through school and everything, and they were so, so lovely to help, and they were in it. As well as my grandparents, June and Eddie Brown, they were they were also in it, and they were, were absolutely fantastic. And the, You could sense the love, you could feel it, it was real. And that's, all, that's what I'm all about. Um, I've also got a problem that when I record the song and release it, the words definitely disappear, so... You'll have to bear with me if I get any wrong. But uh, yeah, I've been Connor Brown. This has been absolutely fantastic, and this is looking for you. I love your body. I love your light inside. That you hide when we're alone. I'll be the one you can phone home. I'll be ready to run, and all through this wind, I'll know what to do. I'll be ready for life, I'll be ready for you.
to close The band is away In the corner of the stage A man starts to play His age is unclear As his ability to steer He tells a story of what was And how we loved and how we lost But when you're alone Thank you. <laughs> like I say, I've been Connor Brown. Uh, this has been Planet Studio Live Session. It is on every Friday at 8 p.m. on the dot, absolutely free of charge. Um, it's absolutely saints work, in my opinion, especially for artists. The music industry is on the brink of collapse at the moment with absolutely nothing to do, and it's killing everything, for me anyway. It's killing everything. My whole family, every, everyone in it is music-orientated. It's their whole life, and there's not really a grant that can save that. It's it's all down to this kind of stuff and your support. So please share this. Tell everybody about it. If you're an artist or a singer, or even if you're not a singer and you want a shot at trying to be one, get in contact and do it. There's no there's no reason why you can't. Everybody's got a voice. Let people hear yours. It's, it's brilliant. Um, like I say, I've been Connor Brown, and thank you very much. I appreciate it. I'll see you next time. <laughs>